The city of Cambridge is being sued to stop the installation of any more bike lanes. Good evening, I'm Paula Eben. And I'm Lisa Hughes. One group claims that these lanes hurt businesses. And as WBZ's Zinnia Maldonado shows us, people living in the area say that's not the only problem. And Dwayne. Harold Gilmer owns a lead barber shop on Mass Ave in Cambridge and has been cutting hair in the neighborhood for 21 years. It's affected everybody around here. The business is not the same. He says the city's current cycling safety ordinance, which calls for bike lanes all along Mass Ave, is hurting local business owners. We've been having parking up and down Mass Ave for this whole time and to pay your bills, you need to have people be able to pull over and, and visit the shops. Other owners agree the new lack of parking means less customers through their doors. We couldn't properly build a customer base. Uh, folks are weren't walking in, so we had to adjust just to survive. We had to start doing more, more takeout and delivery. Proponents of the bike lanes pointing out the city is set to remove the median here between Roseland and Beach Street by the end of July to create more parking spaces in the Porter Square area. We care deeply about making sure that there's sufficient parking, but also want to make sure that people recognize that safer streets that help people move more efficiently through the streets are going to help support small businesses. Chris Casa, volunteer with Cambridge Bicycle Safety, adds nearly two-thirds of the Cambridge community ride bikes, and safety remains the biggest concern. Especially on Mass Ave. So from 2015 to 2021, six people have died on our streets who are biking. 250 people who were biking have been involved in, an, in a crash that was with a motor vehicle that resulted in an injury or more than $1,000 of damage. But if we go out of business, we'll have still a lot of great bike lanes, but it'll be a fallow area. In Cambridge, Zinnia Maldonado, WBZ News.